chapter 3 in verse 14, the Bible decrees the word of God to be so. And God said unto Moses, I am that I am. Yeah. And he said, thou shalt. Glory to God. Pastor Lisa, read that because I got markings all over my Bible. <laughs> and God said unto Moses, yes. I am that I am. Yes. And he said, thus shalt thou say unto the children what of Israel. What is he going to say? I am hath sent me unto you. All right. Glory to God. Find yourself going to the book of John, chapter 11, verse 23. John 11 and 23. The Bible decrees the word of God to be so. Jesus said unto her, thy brother shall rise again. Yeah. Go to Matthew chapter 7 verse 28. Matthew chapter 7 and verse 28. The Bible decrees the word of God to be so. Uh-huh. Matthew 7 and 28. And it came to pass Glory to God. And it came to pass when Jesus had ended these saying, the people uh, were astonished at his doctrine. Glory to God, for he taught them as one having authority and not as the scribes. Amen. Hosea chapter 6 and verse 2, and then we're going to work the scriptures. All right. Is that all right? Yeah, yeah. Hosea, I'm going to the word of God to be so. After two days. Yes. Mm. Wow. Will he ah. revive us? Yes. In the third day, <coughs> he will raise us up. I was on the third floor. Yes. Yes. Uh -huh. He will raise us up and we shall live in his sight. I want you to look at your neighbor eyeball to eyeball. Let's get a little praise share because maybe the person you sitting beside is just trying to put up with you for tonight. And we want to make sure you're sitting by the right person. So I want you to say to them, praise the Lord. you didn't say that because you said praise the Lord. If they didn't do nothing, glory to God, you don't have to move your seat. Tell them and say, you got to move uh, because I'm alive and well. Since they're alive and well, I want you to look at your neighbor eyeball to eyeball. And see, God was running this in my spirit because I let Lancaster, glory to God, saying this. And this is part two of what God was saying in Lancaster. Glory to God. I want you to look at your neighbor and tell your neighbor, go. go. I want you to tell them, go. go. Run. Run. And tell this. Tell them, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on. Cause they about to tear this church up. Glory to God. Glory to God. But you got to tell them what they got to go run and tell them.
y'all looking at me. The reason why you in the hell you in is because you saw the glory and you start going to it. Uh-huh. Yes, Lord Jesus. Well, I might as well work it like I feel it. I said, the Bible says that now Moses is at the top of the mountain and he begins to see this bush and this bush was on fire but it was not being consumed. How is it that everybody is looking at y'all Y'all on fire. Y'all should be consumed with all the hell y'all been going through. But you're still going. But you're still moving. But you're still talking. You're still giving God the glory. Uh-huh. They paying attention. Because that's what Moses was doing. He was paying attention. And the Bible said that when God recognized that the burning bush got his attention, he said, Moses, hold up. Take your shoes off. Because because you're standing on holy ground. I don't need your flesh in this season. I don't need your opinion in this season. I need you to take off what you think. I need you to take off the thing that you, that the place you think you're going to go and you think you're going to do it your way. I need you to take all that off. Uh-huh. Because I'm about to send you to the very people that you were broke out to deliver. Glory to God. I got one one person back there because there's somebody on your job that can't stand you but God sent you to them to break them out and this is the hour and the season that you have to break them out look at your neighbor and tell your neighbor go run and tell this the Bible says that Moses is talking talking to the Lord and saying you're going to send me to a people that don't even know me look me to God what and who shall I tell them that sent me he said tell them I am that I am has sent me so I stopped by decree and declare to tell y'all God sent 
me. Well, who? He said, to tell y'all, I am that I am that sent me to y'all to tell you to tell your neighbor, go run and tell this. Uh huh, baby. Because there's a bunch of lies that's been on you. But I come to tell you, God getting ready. Uh huh, to plead your case. He's getting ready to show the real person that had their foot on your neck. Uh huh, I heard the Holy Ghost say, to you look like you was guilty. Uh huh, you look like you were the one that did. It is something when God tells you not to say nothing. When He tells you to keep your mouth closed, it is something. When you got proof, and God said, don't show the proof. I know I'm walking up in here, but God said, I don't need you to show the proof. I'm going to be the proof that I am your God. And my hand is on your house that I raise you up. 